man, I don't know what the heck this is about to be. I don't know what we doing over in here. You all, it's your boy Ken Rashawn with the one and only. Do, 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 do. They can't trademark that. Built versus bought, and yes, I'm at Top Notch Garage, and they got a notch back that I gotta show the world. I don't know. Do you heard how it started up? I don't know what the heck this thing is, but it's something amazing, and I need you all to see it. So let's talk to the owners of the shop, gentlemen. Introduce yourselves. I'm Kevin St. John, Jeff Thomas. All right, top and notch garage. Top notch. Hold on, let's let 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 me see. Let me let them see the look. Oh, top notch garage. First off, where can they find you all? Okay. Bam, right Ooh, there. Baby. That's where <laughs> sure. they're located. I love it. All right, tell Facebook, me Instagram everything. So tell me a little bit about this build. Uh, this build has been a labor of love for a long time. Um, I did the original fab like through floor subframes and jacking rails and all that. Uh, the summer of 2008 before I went to college. Wow. Uh, so this car has been in process for a long time. It survived uh, a divorce, a couple house moves, uh, a new wife. And baby. Uh, and a baby. Um, and it's finally getting done. All right, so who's the owner of this vehicle? Uh, a good buddy of ours named Brian Thompson. Brian Thompson, shout out to you. All right, so tell us about this motor. What's going on in here? Uh, it's, a, it's a 331, uh, zero balance. It hasn't been on the dyno yet. We're hoping 350, 360 at the tire. Got it, got um, it. The car was originally being built for American Iron, which is a class in NASA that's basically dead now. Okay. Um, so it's really not anything class-wise. American Iron, you're, you're limited to horsepower per weight. Got it. So that would be about right. Um, got it. So now it can make more power, but. Sweet. This is just what's in it for now. Sweet. So I see you all have done a lot of stuff in this engine bay, uh, cleaning it up. I mean, this is a pretty clean, you know, setup right here, you know, for what it is. But this car is used for some different stuff. I mean, you know, you got slicks in the front, slicks in the back. I mean, what's with what, these flares? What, what's going on with this right here? What, what, what's that? Because, you know, Fox Body community ain't used to that. What's going on with this? Uh, this has a full Griggs suspension on it, full Griggs racing. It's a double A arm in the front, um, so no struts. Um, wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely not there. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, watch link, torque arm in the back. Uh, it's Jeez. got a Torsen T2R. I believe it's 373 gears in it. Uh, it was sent to Mosier to put 9 inch ends on it, so it's got good sealed bearings in it now, not the, the um, stock rollers. Got it. Um, that wear out. Got it. Because when you start loading these things big on a racetrack, especially the big tires, it just wears those bearings out and it wow. eats seals. Wow. Well, I mean, this cage is <laughs> it's pretty uh, done up. I mean, you all are definitely protecting yourselves in this. And I mean, you don't have nothing in the side of this car. This is <laughs> this is pretty uh, pretty light. Like yeah. you know, We can't take credit for the cage in this one. Uh, the cage was done. I'm not sure who did the cage in this. That was done while I was away at college. Got it. Um, also, got to give a shout out to our good buddy, Brian Tone, uh, Tone Motorsports. He's done a lot of the stuff on this as well. Got it. Um, and he does amazing work as well. So Love it. A lot of the wiring, a lot of the other fab stuff um, was done by him. So Love shout it. out to him. I mean, and then when you started this thing up, this right here, my, I mean, that thing shook my soul. I mean, this side exhaust, man, and them cabs, man. Like, what type of exhaust is on this car? Uh, it's a custom boom tube that we build. Um, it's just, it's this two and a half inch deed pipe. Say it again. It's a two and a half inch deed pipe. Um, we can, we can put it up. Do you want to see it? Yeah, let's put it up. But this is one of those examples of, man, one of those cars that you don't see often, but that is done amazing. And what you all can't see, the paint on here is immaculate. I mean, this is very, very clean, man. I, I love this build right here. I mean, look, look at, look at what's, gee, I 
lord. Look, look at, my god, look at this. I mean, the definition of clean is definitely this right here. Wow. Wow, wow. So let me just tell you all something. Like, one of the things I like about Top Notch Garage, I love the quality of their work. And this is just a pure example of that quality. Some of you all are looking for somebody to go to and get that quality work. This is the people to come to. But please, don't call them using my name thinking that you're going to get something for $20. They, this, this ain't the place. You go to AutoZone. All right, man, this thing is clean under here. Get, tell, us, tell me a little bit about everything that's going on under here. So this is a Watts link. Um, not, not too common. Probably a lot of people that maybe have never heard of one. They've heard of a Panhard bar. Yep. Um, this is a little different. A Panhard bar kind of makes a triangle if you think about it in the arc. This is more square. Got it. Um, so keeps the car a little bit more planted. This car also has the torque boxes cut out of it. It's got much longer control arms. Wow. I'm going to be honest with you. That's the first time I've ever seen that. Wow. I mean, it's clean under here, too. Like, you all did a good job with getting this undercarriage done. Um, a lot of that was, was our buddy Brian. Um, he said I can't take credit for that. Well, then, shout out to Brian. Brian, you did a great job, man. Like, this is amazing i see the long tube headers like i can I'll, take credit for the exhaust i did that you did this okay everybody so check that out check out this exhaust and i mean i love it coming right out the side i love it i mean like i said it's pretty clean under here man i mean you could eat you could eat dinner off the bottom of this car man like so what's the other plans for it uh we're hoping first outing will be in may okay. at road atlanta uh we'll have uh set a jay zilla track day event okay we should have five Fox bodies that we've done throughout the years. And I'll have my car out there. This car will be its maiden voyage. That's the plan. Nice. Um, Brian will have some cars out there. Our buddy Patrick will have a Fox body out there. So, okay. Um, should be a good time. Sweet. Well, man, I just want to thank you for the opportunity to see this car. And man, we're looking forward to the future. And we will. Bill versus Bot will be at that event. Yes, just sir. want to make that clear to everybody on this channel. So thank you so much, man. And uh, man, looking forward to seeing the progress on this car. All right, so as always, you all know, we're going to bring you some of the baddest cars in the world and some of the, base, the best builds in the world as well. But then we got to highlight some of these amazing shops and Top Notch Garage is definitely that. So make sure you go follow them on Instagram. You saw the back of the hoodie, but make sure you go follow them on Instagram. And if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Let me know what you think in the comments. And if you got something crazy to say, I will block you. It's your boy, Kenneth Sean, Built vs. Bought. I am out.